Hey people, how are you? It's Makeda Valletta. Hope you're having a great day. So, um, I'm reporting live from Cartagena, Colombia. And I just wanted to do a quick video before I go out and enjoy my day. Um, but it is super hot and humid here. It's my first time in South America. Um, but as a fitness person, a lot of you know that I'm into fitness and health. And um, a lot of people who work out and go to the gym a lot, they're always going to the sauna. And I never go to the sauna. Instead, I'm just like, when it's hot and humid in the summertime, just deal with the heat and the humidity. Because you get a natural sauna when you're in that weather, you know? So right now, it's hot as hell here, and I'm not turning on the air conditioner. And it's making me sweat. So I have to keep my hair twisted up, because if I take my hair out, it will just be a mess because of the humidity. But the humidity is also very moisturizing for my hair and for my skin. So it's not good to hold curls or hold a hairstyle, but it does keep your hair moisturized and your skin moisturized. And that's one reason why I also don't like um, the desert. I'm not a fan of the desert because it's dry heat. Dry heat doesn't give you that glow, you know? Like there's this glow you get from humidity. And um, it, when it's really humid, you do not want to use shea butter. Shea butter is excellent for the winter time because shea butter is an insulator. But when it's really hot and humid, if you put shea butter on, you probably have a heat stroke and pass out. So I put some raw coconut oil, I mean, sorry, cocoa butter, cocoa butter on my skin, um, which comes from the cacao plant, which is really cool because um, they grow in Central and South America anyway. Um, so um, that fat to me is very nourishing and it's protective like it protects your sun i mean your skin from the oxidizing properties of the sun but it doesn't block the uv rays you don't want to block the uv rays because then you get vitamin d deficiencies so we want the uv rays but you want to nourish your skin because if you don't put anything on your skin like it is hot but if i didn't put anything on my skin at all then it wouldn't also have the same glow and it doesn't brown the same so you definitely want to moisturize your skin um, coconut oil is cool too, but I just don't think that coconut oil moisturizes deeply enough. Coconut oil gives you a nice shine, and then I feel like it makes you dry. Like, it's kind of drying to me. I prefer cocoa butter. But yeah, I don't do saunas. Instead, I'll take a Haitian dance class or an Afro-Cuban dance class in New Orleans in the summertime. I'll go dance, you know, in some of the hottest places and just keep it hot. You know what I'm saying? Just when it's hot naturally go to sauna but I'm too hyperactive to go sit in a hot room at the gym when I go to the gym I go to work out I'm not trying to sit in a hot room just staring you can't even do shit you can't read you can't you know like I'd rather just be here and be hot and I'm a dance I'm gonna be hot all day and all day tomorrow and I'm not gonna turn the air conditioning on and then my skin will just glow and glow so anyhow um, love humidity humidity is great it's your friend okay so I uh, hope you guys have a good day and I'm going to go find some dancing and some food and I will do another video tomorrow or something, okay? Have a good day. It's also too hot for makeup. That's the other thing. Way too hot for makeup. Way too hot and humid. Okay. Bye-bye.